Imagine plugging your phone into a public charging station and unknowingly handing over your data to hackers. Juicejacking is a type of cyber attack where malicious actors exploit public USB charging stations to compromise devices. Cyber criminals target these stations to turn convenience into chaos. Here's how it works and why it's dangerous. Public chargers in places like airports, malls, hotels, or cafes often serve as lifesavers when your device runs out of battery. However, these USB ports are more than just power sources, they also transmit data. Cyber criminals can modify these charging stations or USB cables to install malicious software or steal data from connected devices. Juicejacking comes in two forms, data theft and malware installation. Data theft happens when a device is connected. The attacker can access sensitive information such as passwords, contacts, emails, messages, or even stored financial data. For malware installation, the attacker uses the connection to inject malware or ransomware into the device. This malware can then monitor activities, steal data, or lock the device for ransom. Malicious actors use multiple techniques when executing juice jacking. The first is the use of compromised cables. An ordinary looking USB cable may have been altered with hardware that enables data theft or malware injection. The second is infected charging stations. Attackers tamper with public USB ports to serve as a gateway for malware delivery. Finally, skimming devices. Similar to credit card skimmers, these can be hidden inside USB ports to record data from devices. Juice jacking is dangerous because it provides wide accessibility like public charging stations, making them easy targets for attackers. This type of attack is a hidden threat. Users may not realize their device has been compromised until it's too late. Once executed successfully, this puts sensitive data at risk. This can include personal information, financial details, and private communications that can all be exposed. There are multiple ways to stay safe from such an attack. First, use a USB data blocker, also known as a USB condom. This device prevents data transfer, allowing only power to pass through. Next, carry your own charger. Use your adapter to connect to an electrical outlet instead of a USB port. Also, you could consider buying portable power banks. Charge your devices using a trusted power bank. Then, disable data transfer. When connecting to a USB port, ensure your device is set to charge-only mode. And finally, be cautious with cables. Avoid using public or unfamiliar cables. Juice jacking shows how convenience can quickly turn into a security risk. Staying aware of this threat and taking simple precautions can protect your devices and data from malicious actors. I hope you found this video helpful. And don't forget tools like a VPN and a password manager are your best friends for staying safe online. Stay vigilant, protect your devices, and share this video to help others stay secure. See you in the next video.